hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel we are going back to back with uploads today i know y'all should be so proud of me because i'm so proud of myself for doing that so today as you read by the title is basic necessities that i have within my little bin my little bin is right here it's, a, it's like a royal blue i kind of like it it's very cute i like the color i got this at the dollar store i know that's obsessed with the dollar store a whole bunch of goodies so this is just all my basic necessities from my perfume to my deodorant to lotion just everything in general like everything in general so most of the stuff i got from the dollar store i might have said that already well if i didn't most of the stuff is from the dollar store it's a lotion it's a whole bunch of other stuff 90 percent of it's from the dollar store a percent and then 10 percent from other stores which i will be I will tell you guys what stuff I got from. So I know you guys probably seen within the corner of it how much of this cocoa butter I have. Okay, I have to be exactly. I have six. Okay, do you think I need six? No, not necessarily. Don't need six, but it's not just me that uses my lotion. It's my brother. He, always, he would always complain about, oh, your lotion smells so garlic. So I just got this. That I do use lotion where I work. It gets very dry. You usually like to keep it in my backpack. So I have six of these. One, two, three, four, five, six. I know you've seen that one for this one, but the fall too. I just like to have lotion. I mean, who doesn't like to have lotion? I mean lotion makes you very easy and makes you smell very good lotion is easy very easy i'm not it's not gonna be a tip how to smell good because that will be like later on in the future so i have six i have a lot of lotion do i keep buying more yes why do i keep buying more good question i can't answer that because i don't know why this is more lotion. This is from the dollar store also. I used to get these all the time. This is a touch of love blackberry and Livic scent. I don't know if that's how you say it. The dollar store. It comes out a little bit thicker. But it still smells good. Like people, like you can't even tell you got it to the dollar store. That's how legit it smells. Is it going to Bath and Body Works? Which I do have some of that. But I get mine. Not at Bath and Body Works. I got plug for that. It's a dollar. It comes out thicker, but it smells really good. So I have three of them. Do I have another one? No. Okay. I thought I also have a whole bunch of like other lotions and perfume on my nightstand, which I kind of felt like I should put in, but I mean, I'll go through and maybe add pictures, and I don't know. So yeah, I just have three of these. These work very, very good. They're the same the lotion, you know. It don't matter if you gonna spend fifty dollars in lotion or a dollar. It's still lotion. So then I do have three Bath and Body Works lotion. This was the only one I got at Bath and Body Works. I've had this for I would maybe say a year and a half, and I never used it. I'm correction. I might have used it once or twice, only because I paid like four dollars for this, and I didn't want to use it. This is a super smooth body lotion, 24-hour moisturizer. And it's Thousand Wishes, which is one of my favorite scents. I paid like $5. I just had it, and I was just like, I don't want to use it. I spent $5 on it, so. It's this. Lotion is lotion. Come on, y'all. Don't matter. These two. These two. I got these as a bundle deal. They came with the perfumes. This is Twisted Peppermint. This is Vanilla Bean Noel. This Vanilla Bean Noel is my favorite scent from there. Like, one of my top favorites. I don't usually shop at Bath & Body Works because it is a little bit on the pricier side. And I don't got that type of money. I'm not rich. I'm a teenager trying to make things meet. Make ends meet. I have perfume. I have the perfume. I have this. I got this as a bundle for $25. And my, I have a plug for this. I'm not going to expose them because I'm not going to tell y'all where because then y'all going to go try to steal it. Just know. I got it. I got it. So next is 
just perfume from the dollar store. Still works the same as any other perfume you spray. It smells good. It really doesn't matter. Kind of, it's just perfume. I, I have, I have perfume that smells good that you can tell I'm wearing some knife some at home. No matter me, as long as I smell it, it doesn't matter to me. So, this is the jackpot. It's actually not the jackpot. I'm just not, I'm just kidding. Yeah. I have deer in it. Okay. Y'all yeah, might be like, why do you need so much? Do you stink? No, I do not stink. I just like to smell good. Because some people don't know how to use this. I got this at Wegmans. Wegmans in a two-pack. I think it, came like, it either came like this, two of the same kind, or one in one. I don't remember. So, I don't really use degree. I usually either use... I haven't used the oven a couple... Like, eight, nine months because it kind of got pricey and I couldn't. It's like $7 for a bottle. So, I just use Lady Speed Stick. This is from the dollar store. It works the same as any other deodorant. Just fun fact, the dollar store has Lady Speed Stick Suave. They have a whole bunch of... They have Old Spice. So, come on. Give give it to the dollar store. I just bought these because I wanted something different. I probably didn't need it, but I bought it. There's, I have a shower clean. I have two shower cleans. They're blue. Then I have two sheer powder. Oh, yeah. So this is my DNA. You know, I put on like three times a day. I always keep one in my purse at school. DNA can be used for so many things. You can put it between your thighs. If you got thick thighs and you don't want, you don't like the rub and just put it there. Just easy like that. So... As I went to my local dollar store, when was it? When, when was the last time I go? Because I gotta stop going. And I think I'm gonna go this Friday too. Because I need, I, the one thing I went for, I didn't get. Didn't that fit? Yep, okay. So I already showed you guys this. This is the Hershey Candy Chapstick Pack. Fun fact I was gonna do a video, the Chapstick Challenge, but things don't work out. So. Yeah, let's just say that. Everyone, if you know me, you know I'm obsessed with chapstick. I don't know why I am. I just don't like my lips to be dry. So, when I went this last time, I picked up two or three packs. This, I seen this as I was walking out to go cash out. And I was like, oh, this looks so cool. So, I have the salt range. Himalayan pink salt lip balm, cherry and shea butter. Now, if you are allergic to certain things or you don't know how your lips are going to react to a certain product, do not try it. Just because I'm showing it to you does not mean to go get it. It's, I don't, I'm not allergic to any ingredients. If I am, then I, I don't know. But I've used the Dallas. I've used Climax. I've never broken out. So, I just have packs of chapstick. Like, I have, I always keep at least five or six chapsticks in my purse at a time. I don't know why. It's just me. So, then I had, I got this the last couple, last two times I went. So, the two times before. This is men. Um, aloe vera chapstick. You know, gotta keep them lips moisturized. I need, to, I need to go to the hair store when this is all over to get more lip gloss. I got this kind. This has nothing to do with the video. I was just talking about chapstick. This, I got Dollar General for like $3. Somebody was like, you can go to the hair store and get this. I was like, yo, what? Really? Let's go. But not during this quarantine because you don't want to catch. You don't want to get it. So these. These are lip balm. Lip balm from LA Colors. I have strawberry watermelon fresh squeeze and cool mint and i think i have a pineapple one too i think i have a pineapple one up there they i was kind of worried that they would show up the exact card they came out as but they really don't they just come out plain chapstick like anybody knows me they knows i love chapstick you never catch my lips chap never catch me lacking over here yeah I realized I organized it the other day. 
and then I realized that I'm gonna have to reorganize it. But just for you guys, I will. Okay. I just have tissue. I bought these a while ago. Like, a while ago. Allergy season is now approaching. I usually keep a pack or so in my purse. So, tissues are always good. Probably wish I would have had these the other day when I made my Snapchat private story video. But it's okay. It, no, it wasn't. But I will be okay. Then I just have, like, a couple more things. I have hand sanitizer. No, I was not being dramatic but when this all started going on. I've I had hand sanitizer in here. I've had it in my purse. So, I got three lavender ones. I thought I had a lemon one, another one, but I guess I don't. I mean, that's okay, though. I mean, hand sanitizer is hand sanitizer. They make a basic, ordinary one, so... So, I got these two things. Three, I like, sorry. This is, I used one before. This watermelon and a loyal. That's how you say it if it's not, sorry. So, basically, this is just like a spray. It gets very sticky, so when, I, when you do it, I recommend you doing it from a distance, like... It comes out it comes out a straight line and usually if I know if I'm taking a shower and I know I'm gonna go somewhere I put it on it gets very sticky so usually after I would hand sanitize and wash my hands after so that's the watermelon it smells so good like put sorry guys if I knew how to edit that I would edit it out so I have two of the same ones and I got this on the cucumber and a loyal one. I'm going to try it on the other side. Probably my other arm would be smarter. Just I'm going to spray. Oh, I thought it didn't work. Just, would I just waste a dollar? Probably would have. To me, it smells the same as watermelon. But maybe that's because I sprayed it or rubbed my wrist together. But just, you know, just like a little quick like spritz. It still works, you know. Come on. This next thing, they each come in packs. So, this these first two I just grabbed. And they're the same kind. So, this is, like, roll-on perfume. Like, you know, you take off the cap and you, like, roll it on. It smells good. They come in little, they come in, like, a two-pack. It's The packaging is so cute. You guys probably seen it in my other hauls. Well, it comes like this. But most of the time, it's, like, half empty. And I don't know why. So... I tried to find the ones with the most pack. And this is just a little lotion. Like, little carry-on lotion. See, I, don't, I didn't even open it yet. You know why? I have so much lotion. And other necessary things. So, I have... I have, like, three more. No, three or four more of these. So, I will get them all. They might not be in the same pairs. But... I have Endless Kisses. This is glitter. This is, a la, like, the La Vida Loca. They have name brand ones. They're exactly the same like this. Um, three more. I might keep one. If I keep one of these in my purse and I throw it down and it breaks, I'm going to ruin a purse. Because I need a new purse and a wallet. I don't need a new purse. I need a new wallet. But it's just nice to have another one. So, there's just three more. Endless Kisses. Wild and in love. <laughs> Must be nice. And it's Endless Kisses. And it's just a little perfume. And then... I have the Endless Kisses, La Vida Loca, and Wild and Love Lotion. Little body lotion. You need a little, hands a little ashy and you don't want to bring out your full bottle. Just da da da. So, that is the emptiness. Just got crumbs in here. I don't know how. So, that is all for today's video. That's all of my haul today. So, I was debating. And I'm going to ask you guys. If you guys could comment down below. Should I get back my Instagram? Because back in the day, I used to have an Instagram, but then stuff happens. So I made a new one, and I just I just made a new account, and I don't use it. So if I should get it back, comment down below, because I think it would be easier to interact with you guys. Because on Snap, I don't want to add people and they start stalking me, which is I'm doing this for my own safety. So, 
I do have a Facebook page. I, it's public. I don't know if I want to do that either. I'll give you guys my Facebook. But, I don't know. So, if I should get Instagram back, please comment down below. I want. To, I would like to do a and a very soon. But I was thinking, like, how would I get the questions? And I'm like, Instagram, pre. So, I'm just putting this stuff back, but. I have my social, I had my TikTok and Snap in the recent video, last video. If I could find, if I could find, like, someone to teach me how to edit, to put it on the screen, I so would. I need someone to teach me how to edit. Because, Lord, I don't think it's gonna cut it anymore. I messed up, like, three times in this video. And it's just gonna stay in. And I get the raw, unedited version of me. Which is okay. Because a lot of YouTubers like to edit everything out. I don't want to be like that. I'm going to give you guys real raw creative content. That's that's what I am. Like when I mess up. I want you guys to see that. When I stutter or mess up, I'm not going to cut that out. Because everyone has their struggles. Everyone has their imperfections. And that's something with mine that I have. Um, I think that's it. I mean, I'm just putting everything back. Which I thought it was going to take a lot longer. They actually didn't. So comment down below what kind of videos you would like to see. I do have a notebook idea. Or a notebook idea. Totally big. I do have a notebook. Like I showed you guys in the last video. I have. Let me just cross out. Because what I just did. So I have two more. To do. One is another haul. You guys are probably sick of. But it's okay. And then I have a sit down video. Which I don't know if I want to sit up here and do it or actually go somewhere else in my household and talk about it so comment down below for more video ideas and i will gladly i will gladly do them because during this quarantine what else do we gotta do nothing so thank you guys for tuning in to my video today i really do appreciate every single one of you guys even though i'm very i'm a very small youtuber like super small i'm like almost 70 subscribers it's not a lot to y'all but to me it is a lot i mean 70, 70 people tune in to watch me that's the best so i want to say thank you guys for tuning in today's video and i hope you guys enjoyed it and don't forget to follow me on my socials down below and i will think about getting instagram if i get enough people telling me i should but that is it for today's video thank you guys see ya